Okay, today I'm going to show you how to make Hello Kitty bow. Okay, all you really need is some paper. This really needs kind of I want to use this kind of paper. Um, I let up a red pin that has a good lead. I mean, a lot of ink like mine in a pink sharpie in an eraser okay an eraser so first what you do is draw a circle in the middle okay so an oval sort of well if you have paper like mine just draw I thought you I'll just draw it in between one thing so it could be even like this. Then going to make an opening spot like this. So like this. Okay. This is how I want to draw the ball. Okay, then it goes in. Okay, like that, and then do the other side. Like that. So the edge should look like that. But if you want, you could draw one looking like this. Which is sort of its type of bone. Okay, this type of bone. But I prefer it the other way because that way it's cuter. And plus, I don't really know how to draw that kind. See, compared to this one, to that one. But back on this one. So. Get your red pen and like trace it so I can see more because at first it was pretty light. You can, you can have a red or pink pen, but I'm using a red one. I like red and pink. Okay, so. Then, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you, you need a pink marker. Hold on, I'm trying to find my pink marker. Well, really, okay, a pink marker. Okay, get your pink marker, and in the middle, color it in. Then get your highlighter. I mean, like, be your highlighter or your sharpie. Mine is a highlighter, bright, bright light highlighter. So, but I prefer you should use a highlighter, a pink highlighter, because like it's more gooder and plus that's how this thing goes so so after you get them coloring it like that you get your red paint and retrace it but dark really dark just really dark well not really really dark but so you can see the red a little bit Okay, you did that, right? Then, you're going to draw, like, um, and draw a squiggly line. I don't know if you can see it, well, but you're going to draw a squiggly line going like that. So, you can draw a squiggly line, so, so you got the bow thing. 
right? So, got the ball thing. Right here, we have the bow thing. You're gonna draw a squiggly line right there in the middle. You see it? Yeah. Now you should see it right there. So, but it should be on here, this side. Then you're gonna do it on the other side, the opposite side. Like this, so I forgot the other one. The other one. These are not even though, but got the other one. Right here. Hold on. I don't know if you can see it, but it's right here. You're going to draw it the opposite, so it's going to be like this. Okay? that so you see on this one on this one it got it on the up but on the other one that's on the down so it's like this well I can see it good but I don't know if y'all can see it but I'll get my red marker and trace it it's not gonna look good but I mean my black I can do it so you can see so it should be like that don't bring it back but I'm gonna paint it in black so you can see it. Okay. It should be a squiggly line like that. It looks ugly because I I had used it black. And then after that you're going to do it again. But different. Okay, the magic all sizes. Okay, then you're gonna get your purple highlighter and then trace it again, like how you did the red one. It doesn't show, but there you get your pencil and just kind of like make it a little shadow. Make it a little shadow. Okay? Then, after that, you get your eraser. You're going to erase the shadow, but you're not going to erase it all the way. So, like, if I have a shadow thing, right? Right here. If I have a shadow thing, and I'm going to draw my name. I mean, my letter's my name, then I'll do some, which is P for pairs. I'll never see it, but I erase some of it. Put P for pairs. That's what you're going to do, but you're going to trace the bow in. Okay? Like, still leave some shadow left, but, like, you know. So, let me do it, and then I'll show y'all how I did it. really hard but if you come and do it somehow it's not okay kind of I messed it up erasing but I could fix it easy as possible
Okay, so he's gonna have a little cute shadow. Okay, looks like this, but you can't really see my shadow in, but I'll bend it like this, and you might see it good right here. All right, that's how you make a Hello Kitty book. That's how I make it. Like. I might not make it like that, but that's how I make it. Like, if I'm drawing Hello Kitty, that's how I make it. Like that. Like, hold on, let me, let me fold it in so y'all can just see the square. I mean, the bow. It's good. The bow is cute, if I don't want to do it. It's really cute. That's how you make it, if y'all want to make it end up like that. Okay. So, instead, I can't really see my shadowing. Um, I'm going to get my blue highlight. It looks like this, but it's going to be blue. And then I'm going to show you where I, uh oh, wrong one, that was my other one, my dark one, I like my light one, I was just show, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you where I have pitted the shadowing at, it's mostly like I traced it, but I traced it in let me get my other color to the hat. Erase it again and then do it again. Get my green so I can show you. Let me trace that. Oops, that's what I did. Like that. That's how. Uh, oh, hold up. That's how I make it. Okay. Thank you. And have a nice Hello Kitty. Bow day.